Hi, this is Thunder E from BorderWork.com and today we'll be showcasing a very cool case for your iPhone 4S. This is the LifeProof case. And as you can see from the packaging, this case protects your phone from water, dirt, snow, as well as it is, it is shockproof. So basically, this transforms your iPhone, which we all know tends to have uh, broken displays left and right, you've seen friends with it, um, into an almost indestructible phone, kind of like the Rugby Smart um, and the phones like that. But anyway, uh, the cool thing about this is not that it just protects your phone, but there are cases that do that. But it's actually super light. This is, I mean, the case itself I'm holding it is just very light. So I'm wondering how well can something this light protect your iPhone. Now, it, it basically is only 1.5 millimeters thick, so it increases your iPhone from uh, your 9.8 to something about 10.5, roughly. Cool packaging. You can see the packaging here. Um, very slick. It's got an anti glare protector at the back, so it allows you to actually take your photos properly. Um, so let's go ahead and open this up uh, instead of us just yapping here left and right. So put the case aside. Here, what we do have here is an underwater um, headphone adapter. So this allows you to actually use, um, they also sell, um, you know, headphones you can swim with. You can actually plug this into your iPhone, attach, and you can actually listen to music while swimming or laying in the lake or something like that or in the pool, doesn't matter. So this is a cool, nice little attachment here. Here is your case. What you do have here, um, you do have some instructional material, they do have bike mounts, armbands, floating lanyards, belt clips, so on and so forth. Recyclable packaging, which is pretty cool. Um, inside here, you do have your instructions, which you can, can download, warranty information, all that fun stuff. You do have nice uh, clean cloth, and here is the back of the case. You can see the back of the case. Uh, you can see the clear plastic at the back for your camera. It's caution here, life proof. This is a white case. We're going to slide our iPhone in there. Uh, it works for the iPhone 4, iPhone 4S, for AT&T, Verizon, and Sprint. This is the main body of the case. It's got this nice thin film, which um, you can use to access your keys. You can see all the ports basically for your front facing camera, the sensor. It's also got, um, um, you can see the designs here, so you can actually. Hit, of course, your buttons on the side. Uh, of course, this is the port for the headphones, which you unscrew. The power button on the top. And this thing, I mean, it's very light. seems very light, very flimsy, actually. So we're going to actually do run it through some tests. So since it claims to protect your phone, we're going through in the dryer. We're dipping in some water, and we're just going to drop it around. We'll you know, test some heat and, and shock in there. Um, also, uh, the design actually allows helps increase your sound value. You get some very good bass off this. So we'll play some music and see how well it sounds underneath all this stuff in here. So we'll slide into our iPhone, and we'll see how it well it works. All right, so we have our iPhone here, and we have our life-proof case. So we are going to slide this in. Should fit snug in there. Oh, uh, wait a minute. We do need to take away our um, headphone plug just to make sure. Slide this in. Oops, wrong way. Should fit in there snug. The back piece. I'm just going to leave the caution sign there so you guys can see. And then make sure you snap it in. It must be tightly sealed or else chaos will ensue and you will have water, dust, and well, you know, God knows what else in there. But it snaps into place. You can see the uh, port is accessible. You can plug in your um, iPhone charger there. Snap. Put this in. And we have our case. Pretty quick, very simple. All right, so we're by the dryer. We have our iPhone on life proof case. I'm actually going to be recording what happens in there while we're testing out its uh, durability and heat resistance. So I'm going to hit record. It's recording. I got my flash on. Toss this in there. 
and we'll spin it for about a minute or two. It's almost a minute, so check out our iPhone. Wow, it's hot in here. Still recording. Record about a minute 40 seconds. You can see it's still functional. I'm gonna stop recording. Looks fine. There you have it. Still works. Feels a little warm course it was in the dryer but so far smooth so now we're going to drop it into a nice so we just finished our heat and uh, durability test you can see there are very little scuffs around this and there's no damage to the screen which one thing to note that the edges are raised so it'll be very hard to actually hit the screen because you have raised edges so even if it falls flat unless of course it's a sharp object or something hits that so we're gonna do a little water test here you can see we have a nice bucket of water, a uh, bowl of water actually. And listen to some music. All of underneath there. Keep it for about 30, 40, 40 seconds. So you can enjoy the music while you're listening. It's on the water and you can still hear that quite clearly. Even much better if I actually lift it up, so. Sound travels well. No issues. Take it out, stop that. And again, they do have uh, um, waterproof headphones, so if you're going swimming and you want to listen to your iPhone while swimming, that's something you can do uh, with this case. But it's nice that you see that it actually functions um, well underwater um, no issues smooth uh, again there's no um, there's no access of there's no actually seepage of water into the case uh, all you just do is just wipe it off and you're good to go uh, the screen itself uh, the film is actually pretty close to the screen so you're getting just straight contact on your iPhone screen directly now the camera the front facing camera feels a little looks a little fuzzy um, I'll show you that in a second because it doesn't really have the anti glare screen. It just uses this film in front, although the rear camera actually looks pretty good. And you can still take some very good stills and pictures and things like that on there. I'm going to show you if I can show you that clearly. Hopefully, you guys can see that. Overall, um, I like the case, uh, I think it does a solid job for what it is. Um, it's uh, $79.99. Um, a little pricier than other other uh, you know protective cases that are military grade, but this is definitely uh, a case that actually is more streamlined and keeps the iPhone look and structure. So you don't look like you're carrying a tank or you know uh, 
a brick on your ear just because you want to protect your iPhone case. So this is something where you know it looks like an iPhone, still feels like an iPhone, and you can use it around anywhere. And like I said, you know, you can drop it around and you know it's dust proof, is soundproof and all that stuff. Um, some of the buttons might be a little bit hard to reach and get into. It's not that hard. You just have to press a little bit harder than the normal. That's something I advise most people anyway but um, it does work all the buttons do work well it's just you know gotta get used to actually tapping a little harder than uh, you would uh, on your normal iPhone but again it's easy it keeps your iPhone safe clean it's easily accessible to charge but it's open up the port here you see that and you can see it's just dry in there you lock that up and it's pretty cool um, so I do recommend the life uh, life proof case I think it's one of the better iPhone cases I mean overall compared to any other case out there uh, that gives you full protection for your iPhone it's MSRP $79.99 you can find it at Best Buy various stores all that uh, good stuff so if you guys have any questions about the life proof iPhone 4 case and this works for the iPhone 4 and 4s let us know uh, don't forget to subscribe to all your all our pages on Twitter Facebook Facebook, YouTube, Pinterest, Empire Avenue, Board Femme, her Twitter channel, and um, yeah, just follow us on all those avenues. And uh, thank you very much. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this review.